This space here doesn't look super flat, but it is in a super flat world. And on this world, which is a server with a bunch of my friends, we're gonna play Secret Santa today. Let's go to the shopping district and check out who I got. So now I'm still wearing the Mambo Jumbo skin, but I'm not gonna change that for now. Because I just want to get my random name. Starboard Venus. Actually, this is great. I think I've got a lot of options to do here. That's right. I've now gotta get a present for Starboard Venus. Let's sleep first though. Uh, why is there a creeper? Why is that necessary? Need to light up my base again. But what would you gift someone for Christmas in Minecraft? Well, I'm gonna gift I, B and G. Items, a build and a game. So first of all, let's try to get as many and as rare items as possible and hopefully some of them are also useful. Step 1. Items. So I think a good place to start for that is to get a bunch of rockets and fly to the end. So let's go to the industrial district and let's get some sugar cane from here. I think that should probably be enough. And also this gunpowder. So I can craft paper and rockets. Yeah, this and all of this should be enough. I may have even overdone it a little bit. So let's pack that in the ender chest and fly off to the end portal. So here I am, let's find a portal that was hopefully not visited yet. This one, hopefully. Ah yeah, I think I cleared out a lot of chorus fruits here. But that's no problem. I can just fly in this direction. So how much good loot can you get in the end? in let's say four hours let's test it out So it's the next day now and I would have like 20 more minutes but the problem is that I didn't really take any food with me except the three stacks of bread I had. So now I'm out of food and I think I need to get back as soon as possible. I am gonna take one more free elytra though. There it is and some loot as well. And there are support, nice. Home. So now after about 10 minutes, I've sorted everything I got into these boxes, starting with a lot of valuable stuff over 4 stacks of shulker shells, also over 2 stacks of diamonds, then a lot of horse stuff and the elytras and then the tools, tools and then the armor. And I'm not 100% sure what to gift Starboard Venus, but I'm gonna take a few seconds to think about it and get together one shulker box with a lot of valuable stuff. Who committed this crime and why would somebody do something like that? I guess I also gotta commit a crime. Floating tree, but at least I can fix this. And now, a few minutes later, I got this. I think that's pretty good and it's basically all stuff that you can get from end trading. Starboard box. Also, we got a texture pack so I can wear one of these now. And I just realized that I'm at the wrong FOV. Way better. So let's make the box purple like Starboard Venus hats I've got here. And I know it's hat but I don't wanna run back, make it yellow again and then make it purple again just so that I say it right in the clip. Gotta live with it. And with that, in English weather, I've completed part 1 of getting items for my present. And part 2 is gonna be building something. Step 2. Building and a little game. First I need some obsidian and a flint and steel. So now I'm on the nether roof and I'm gonna build a big portal. 10 blocks wide and 12 blocks high, I think. And done, light it up and I will spawn at... Great, right above the ocean. Wait, this is in my industrial district. I guess I gotta move the portal somewhere else. Isn't it fun to destroy 40 blocks of obsidian? A whole lot of fun. So hopefully this location is better suited for the portal. And 
Bond, where is it gonna be? Perfect. And now I just need over 34 stacks of wool. To be more specific, I need mostly red wool. So let's craft red dye and search for a bunch of fences. And then I also need a lot of wheat. Then I remember that I had a lot of sheep here. Yeah, here they are. And those aren't red yet, have to be colored red. Although most of them actually already were. Don't even know what I use them for anymore. Red, red, you stay white. Now let's get some wheat so that they can follow me. And now I've accumulated all of the sheep around me. So I'm not gonna have them run at me anymore. But I'm gonna try to make them stay inside this fence, please. Don't run away. I do have to get a few of them back in. But now that's done. And I can get shears and shear them and breed them. And shear them and breed them. And shear them and breed them. Until in probably a few hours I have enough wool. now a little bit of playing later I've got a bunch of sheep and also more importantly a lot of wool over the shulker box of red wool and here's the rest and a little bit of white so as this is gonna be a Christmas present let's build a little present package for that I have to go to the portal and in there and this is where I'm gonna build the package although first I have to fix this portal so now I've moved the portal up and made it a little bit bigger now I've built the present, to be honest it doesn't look as good as I thought it would, I think I'm gonna have to add some detail later, gonna improve that in a second, but first I need to go to the magical make me small portal, because if I hop into this, everything around me should become bigger, so that I myself feel smaller, that's essentially the plan with this, I'm gonna build the same package around this again, but in like 3 times as big, so that you feel like you're 3 times as small. Let's do the time lapse. And now it's already midnight, but I finally finished this thing and I also can't talk anymore as you heard. But I think it looks pretty good. It's uh, relatively big, not huge though. And if you go in, it looks even bigger, I think. And now let's go back to normal size. Ah, uh, yeah, that's the size I like being. Nice. And now, as the last step, we need to build something that is fun. Kind of like a game. So, I've now planned some uh, little mini game to do with redstone, where I don't need that many resources. Also, I'll pin the first comment that can tell me what country flag this is. I've now got all the redstone resources right in here. And in about two minutes, I should have built the whole thing. So, now everything for the present is prepared. And when Starboard Venus comes here, he's gonna be able to enter it. And then he can use the shrinker to get shrink down. And once that's done, he can shoot the lamps with a bow that I'm gonna put in here, but I already got it in my inventory. So, shoot lamp one, shoot lamp two, shoot lamp three, and shoot lamp four. And then this box dropped with all the good stuff in there. Very nice. So let's skip to the day where we give this to him. Step 3. Secret Santa Party. Now we all met up, all of us and only being three people to do the I present thing. Only three people. I mean more yeah, people did so the presents but they don't all have time. So Slim Chi, you wanna show us who, who are you secret centering for? Oh, you. oh my god, what a surprise! One hour earlier. Go in your storage, go in your storage. Um, four ba- Oh, wow, why? Thanks. It, it's, it's the present. Well, that's great, but we were gonna do it in, at the meeting in an hour. You saw nothing? No, no. <laughs> so this is what you got. Okay, Nether Star, really good, 10 out of 10. Okay, this, so is this is what I got, I got you some horse leather. That's some nice. Webs, oh. Some ancient debris that's fake that you gave uh, me. Please, please, some can insects, we... because those are limited. 
and some gold because you totally don't have a farm. Okay, gold not that helpful, but dragon heads are cool, elytras are nice, and I like horse leather and cobwebs are also very rare. Thanks for this. Yeah. So oh, Patrick, you wanna show us your secret center thing? Um, well the thing is, I... Okay. So, as I was telling you, I might have told you this before, but I think... <laughs> oh, oh, wait, like we need to start it. again. I can't put it in the video with slim case background noise. So, you wanna show us your thing? Your okay. The center? funny thing is, um, I have my present ready, but I was gonna build it, and in the middle of it, there was gonna be a chest with clues, and then the clues would go you around, make you go around the map, and I see. look for other clues, and then at the end, I have the treasure hidden somewhere. Who is it for? Uh, knife, spider lame. Ah, and can you show it to us what you're, what he's getting in the end? Well, yeah, sure. Oh my god, this is so good, I'm off. No! <laughs> it's not that good, I just, I didn't really know what to do. See, see the way it shows a clue there? See that pay piece of paper, it says read this aloud to everybody and check your DMs. I was gonna make a custom texture pack for him, with a totem of him, yeah. and I was gonna send it to him the second he read it out. Do you like the idea? Yeah. yeah. Nice. Oh, wanna see my present? I yes, hope please. you have me because I think you made something. Okay, first of all, I have Starboard Venus. Sorry to disappoint you. Oh. And then I showed them my thing, but you already saw it, so here's their reaction. I would just wanna know as a feedback how do you feel about it on a scale from 1 to 10? Compared to mine. Hey. I, I, I should it's say it's a 1 out of 3.5 Danish potatoes. That was great feedback, but what did Starboard Venus think when he received his present? So Starboard Venus is now coming and he's gonna go to his present. Probably gonna arrive here in about a minute. And he thinks I'm AFK at my mob farm, so even if he sees I'm on, he's not gonna expect me to be here. Hello! <laughs> you want one? Yeah, order. Oh, so I look like I have a pumpkin on. So, this is your present. You were just shrunk down. You're now only a third of your normal size. Of course. Nice. Nice. I was about to say you were surprisingly good. Oh. And something might just have rained from the roof. You picked it up. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, I, I went end raiding for like four hours, and then I got some stuff together. I hope you like it. Oh my goodness! Thank you so much. And Whoa. Merry Christmas. Thank you. Now see you gotta edit the episode for tomorrow, and get back to normal size, of course. So, please subscribe, because as soon as this channel gets monetized, I'm gonna donate all of the money I don't need, but I will still get for Christmas this year, to the Marine Conservation Institute, and also, Merry Christmas.